house hallelujah come on let's welcome the lord in the house hallelujah well i barely came to praise him tonight uh, hallelujah hallelujah come on let's get to our feet come on let's worship him uh, let's welcome the lord in the house tonight uh, hallelujah 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 Come on, let's put our hands together. Hallelujah. Well, we come to praise Him. We come to praise Him. We come to praise Him and lift His holy name. Oh well, we come to praise Him. We come to praise Him. We come to praise Him and lift His holy name. Let's do it well one more time. We come to praise Him. We come to praise Him. We come to praise Him and lift His holy name. We'll make a joy for noise, make a joy for noise. And to the Lord, we'll make a joy for noise. And to the Lord, you want a person more while you have a chair. Oh, yeah, well, we got the praise. Make a job and I make a job and I do the Lord. Make a job and I do the Lord. And to the Lord. Well, you want to praise the Lord while you have a chance. Oh, yeah. Well, we got to praise him. We come to praise Him. We come to praise Him. We come to praise Him. And in His holy name. Yeah! We come to praise Him. 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 And in His holy name. Come on, let's praise Him. Come on, put those hands together. Hey! Make a joyful noise, make a joyful noise. We come to praise We come to praise Him. 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 Everybody say we come to praise him. 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 We 
Look him right in the eye. Whoa, Just you go Satan in the name of Jesus. He gave you power from the old high. He gave you power from the old high. He gave you power from the old high. And he'll flee from you in the name of Jesus. He won't have to cry. When troubles come around. Do you feel so all alone? Think you have nothing for my friend, you're so wrong. Now old Satan here to save you and have you believe a lie. Unless you stand on a solid rock and look him right in the eye. Just if you go Satan in the name of Jesus, he gave you power. From on high, in the devil, and he'll flee from you. In the name of Jesus, he won't have to cry. Just if you go Satan, in the name of Jesus, he gave you power. From on high. In the name of Jesus, you won't have to cry. In the name of Jesus, you won't have to cry. Hallelujah. How many is free tonight? I say, how many is free tonight? Oh, hallelujah. I'm so glad that we serve a God tonight who can bring you out of the mighty clear. That put your feet on a solid rock to say, Look out of somebody. Uh-huh. Hallelujah. When we first left Egypt, it all fit to me was fine. Little did we know that Pharaoh was not there. With Pharaoh's army behind, and the race he before. Moses lifted up his body, called out of heaven and love for the sea's been. Body left to, oh, 
Came down and took so me in my past tense to me to me and me I'm going to live 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 I'm going to live
the land of endless glory found found my listener view standing by the river And our pastor, a great big hand clap tonight. Thank you. Good job. Oh, that's a good job. Hallelujah. Lord, I tell you, standing by the river. Oh, hallelujah. I hear the angels. Amen. Praise God. They something. Amen. About. Amen. The servant Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. I'm going to sing a song tonight. Amen. Praise the Lord. And I'd like to ask my people to help me if they would. Uh, they uh, I don't like to help me because they don't know what key I'm going to sing in. And I don't know what key I'm going to sing in. And they don't know what to play in. <clears throat> Amen. Praise the Lord. But nevertheless, this song is going to go along with the, the message tonight. Amen. <clears throat> and uh, if I was a great singer, I'd probably be in Nashville. You know, but that's the reason I'm not down there, amen. Praise the Lord, but Nashville won't let me preach like I do here, amen. Praise the Lord, thank God, amen. <clears throat> but uh, give Jesus a great big hand clap. I don't know about nobody else, but this time of year I have an allergy problem, amen. Praise the Lord, and sometimes it really works on you. But one of these days, we're going to a place where there won't be no allergies. <laughs> Title is song nice, Two Coats. Two coats were before me, the old and the new. I 
could I have either? So what must I do? The first coat was ugly and purple worn. The other new one had never been worn. I'll tell you the best thing I ever did do. I took off the old coat and put on Tell you the best thing I ever did do. I took off the old coat and put on the new. The old coat was earthly and not fit to work. I thought of it often and shed many a tear. But there was a clean one presented to view. So I laid off the old coat and put on the new. I'll tell you the best thing I ever did do. I took off the old coat and put on the new. I'll tell you the best thing I ever did do. I took off the old coat and put on First man was earthly and made from the ground. We buried him in the whole world around. Next was my savior from heaven so far. He gave me this you go. You now see me where I will glory. I'll tell you the best thing I ever did do. I took off the old coat and put on the new. I'll tell you the best thing I ever did do. Took off the old coat and put on the new. Now this coat fits me and keeps me so warm. It's good in the winter. It's good in the storm. My Savior distressed me and garment so rare. He fills me with glory, his image I burn. I'll tell you the best thing I ever did do. I took off the old coat and put on the new. I took off the old man and put on the new. Hey, man, praise the Lord. Thank God. Hallelujah. Glory. Amen. I thought you'd done a good job. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank God. Amen. And I'd like to preach just a little bit maybe tonight. Praise the Lord from uh, Ephesians chapter 4 beginning at verse 17. Amen. And if I was to title this message tonight, 
it would be putting on the new man amen and how many knows we need to put on the new man we need to lay off the old man we need to lay off the old coat and put on the new one amen and I thank God tonight amen because that's the best thing I ever did do amen and you that's a Christian tonight that's the best thing that you ever done in your life it's when you lay the old man off and put on the new man. Oh, thank God tonight, amen, because, honey, the Spirit of the Lord will come in too. Honey, that old man and make a new man out of you. Amen, and I want you to know something. Amen, if you got turned to Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 17, everybody holler, Amen. amen. All right, we're going to go right down into the Word of God. Amen. The Bible said this, I say therefore, and testify in the Lord, that ye henceforth walk not as other Gentiles walked in the vanity of your mind. Amen. I want you to know something. A lot of people is walking in the vanity of their mind, and vanity is sin. Amen. Honey, they're in the natural and the carnal mind and the carnal mind is enemy against God amen but when we come out from amongst her amen and begin to put on the new man and we begin to put on Christ Jesus honey they something in your most inner beings amen is different to what you was before honey I'm so glad we're in the world Ha, but we are not of the world. Ha, amen. That's what Jesus said. Ha, he said he was in the world, but he was not of the world. Ha, and that's why he said, come out of her, my people. Ha, honey, when we get saved, we come out of her. Ha, amen. I want you to know that. Ha, honey, I'm so glad that I know. Ha, amen. That Jesus, when he saved me, ha, he gave me the right mind. Ha, amen. He gave me the right spirit. Amen. To pick up the cross. Honey, I follow him. I don't regret them all. Honey, that I've traveled for the Lord. Amen. Because amen, he is the way maker. Honey, the way is already been made. Can I believe tonight what does saith the word of the Lord? My godly son. Amen. And I believe what the word said. Amen. And the Bible said, having the understanding, darken them being, alienated from the life of God through the ignorance and in this handy arm because of the blindness of their heart. Amen. You know, God wants your heart. Amen. From the abundance of the heart, honey, the mouth speak up. Whatever's in that heart, honey, that's what's going to come out. Yeah, man, thank God. Honey, that heart's got to be pure and undefiled before God. Amen. God will take the old stony heart out. Amen. And give you a heart of flesh, honey, a heart of love. Amen. And the love of God. I will cover a multitude of sin. And you say amen tonight. Thank God I'm glad. Amen. That from the mouth. Amen. The Bible said they speak from their lips. But the heart is far from him. Amen. And we see this today. Honey, from a lot of people. Honey, we've got people. That's not apostolic Jesus name. Honey, talk talks more about Jesus huh, and the apostolic does. Huh. Amen. Everybody you see about it, huh, honey, they say they're a Christian. Huh, and they go to church, but what kind of church is that? Huh. Amen. The church of Jesus Christ huh, honey, is the church. Amen. Huh. Honey, but if you don't belong to him, huh, you just got to gather on huh, and you say amen. Huh. Honey, I want you to 
know something I'm glad and I know for sure honey that God liveth amen Jesus is the way honey the truth and the life I'm the deal cut of my God and I understand what the word of God is saying well glory honey as we look into the gospel on the Jesus Christ and we begin to find out amen there ain't but one way amen one way honey to glory one way to the kingdom of God and Jesus said he was the way the truth and the life and without him you don't have no life a sinner oh, a sinner that's walking around in this world honey they're walking around as a dead man amen you don't have life until you come to Jesus Christ and you repent of your sins amen and get born again and go down to that watery grave and buried with him amen when you come out of that watery grave and you walk in the newness of life thank God there's a change made I said there's a change made yeah man honey the Bible said who been past past feeling have given themselves over to lessness to work all uncleanness with greediness amen I want you to know honey there's a lot of people honey they cannot feel God I'm no man is on his deathbed amen that used to preach some amen used to go to church and he said I cannot feel anything it's a sad thing honey to come up on your deathbed and you can't feel God honey you can feel this God honey that I'm preaching about tonight you can feel him in your most inner beings I thank God he said out of your belly I shall flow rivers of living water and he spoke of the Holy Ghost on the deal and you can feel this God like you all felt here in the beginning you felt like running you felt like shouting you felt like speaking in tongues honey it's not all just about the feeling honey but when the spirit of the Lord comes down it'll make you do something and you say amen I said it'll make you do something it'll make you raise your hands it'll make you holler amen it'll make you holler preach it preacher oh we cut them all honey if you don't feel anything you're not going to do anything amen because your heart it's got to be in this thing honey all the way I'm not just part of the way honey but it's got to be all the way honey my heart's desire honey is to serve Jesus my heart's desire is to read the word of God my heart's desire is to see the lost saved and see the backsliders come back to God and see the people baptized in that watery grave honey that's my heart's desire tonight honey God call me to preach honey to the lost and he said abide in your calling honey where you are called well hallelujah honey it's a five fold ministry amen one preacher don't have it all and you say I don't care if they tell you they got it all honey they lied to you and the Bible said all liars shall have their part in the lake of fire which burned with fire and brimstone well hallelujah if one minister had it all it wouldn't be a five fold ministry well glory honey I'm here to tell you I'm glad I know honey what God has called me to do and I'm glad I know I obey God well hallelujah 
and I believe God is going to save the lost and I believe God is going to bring the backsliders back he told the backslider he said return unto me and I'll return unto you he said I'm married to the backslider he's married to you well hallelujah honey I'm so glad amen that he gave me honey that opportunity and he gave me a change well honey I'm honey from the abundance of my heart honey the mouth speakers well hallelujah I'm on that praise him hallelujah I feel the glory of God. Amen. And he said the 21st, but ye have not so learned Christ. Amen. There's a lot of people tonight. They haven't learned of Christ. They don't know Christ. They only know what some preachers preach to them. Amen. Or some neighbor. Amen. But you need to know for yourself and not another. And I began to search the word of God. Amen. When my wife was going to church, I was given the Bible. And I was raised in Trinity. Amen. I was believed there was three gods. Amen. And while she was going to church, I would read the Bible. I trying to prove her wrong. And the more I read it, and I read myself into it. I didn't have nothing I need to argue with her about it and then say amen you know there's a lot of people and they would see who Jesus is if they would study the word if they would search the word and you've got to get it for yourself well hallelujah Jesus will reveal himself unto you if you've got a heart's desire I need to know who Jesus is. Well, hallelujah. Honey, we're going to preach Jesus Christ and him crucified. He's the Lord of glory. He's the King of kings. And he's the Lord of lords. And it's a devil. I believed in one God. And he trembled. I thank God. And he has the devil in the beginning of time. And he was up there with God. He knew who God was. Well, hallelujah. I'm here to tell the people that Jesus is the one true living God. And he's the one you stand before on judgment day. Thank God. Hallelujah. You and I stand before three gods. And then you stand before one God. Amen. And he's got the angel. Oh my God, hear me. I'm here to preach something to you. Amen. Put off the old man and put on the new man. And then when you come to Jesus, amen, there's a change. And it takes place in your life. And not only you know it, and your neighbors will know it, your family will know it, your friends will know it, and those that you work with. I need to know it. I don't want to cut them off. Oh, I feel something tonight. I feel the power of the Holy Ghost. That devil's a liar and a father of it. Yeah, man. You know the devil come to kill. He come to steal. He come to take your joy. Amen. But Jesus come to give you love and give you more abundantly. And it don't matter how good you do. Somebody's going to talk about you. Somebody's going to put you down. Somebody's going to try to destroy you. Somebody's going to try to stop you. But this earth ain't no stopping place for me. Well, hallelujah. He said, count it all joy. Hallelujah. 
Oh, I feel good tonight. I thank God. Amen. The 21st verse said, If so be that ye have heard him and have been taught by him, is the truth is in Jesus. Amen. I want you to know, honey, the people come here to the Bible Way Church, they cannot say, I haven't heard about Jesus. They can't never say, I never know there was just one God. Amen. Because we preach at not one service, but practically ever service. And it's brought out somewhere, somehow. Amen. And I want the people to know, amen, that Jesus is watching over us. Amen. Yes, he is. And we're here to help you. Amen. Through this old world. Amen. And every day that we live, honey, you're going to face troubles. You're going to face problems. You're going to face situations. You need somebody that you can trust. Somebody that you can depend on. Honey, to tell you honey, about the word of God. Honey, I don't have time for gossip. I don't have time to hear you talk about somebody and put somebody down. But I do have time to tell you about Jesus. I'm the more we got, the more we got to you. And if there ever was a time, honey, we need to pray and seek the face of God. Honey, it's the time that we're living in. Honey, the Bible said evil man would wax worse and worse. And we see that all over the world. Honey, it's a come on. Honey, Jesus is come on. And all this stuff that's coming up on the world, honey, is going to bring him quicker. And you can depend on. And he'll come in the hour that you think not. In the hour you're not looking for him. He will have him or he cut him or cut And he won't surprise me if the rapture don't take place. Honey, any time. Well, hallelujah. Honey, I'm here to tell you. I believe some of the word of God is being fulfilled. And we don't even know about it. Well, hallelujah. And when this word is fulfilled, according to the scripture, honey, Jesus is going to come. Well, hallelujah. Amen. I look every morning out of my window. And I say, Jesus, it's today the day that you're going to come. Well, hallelujah. Amen. I want you to know something. We need to do everything in our power. Like today is the last day upon earth. And it is for a lot of people. Amen. Who will be the next? Will it be you or will it be me? But I'll grant you one thing. It'll be somebody. Amen. Yes, it will. Amen. Pick up the paper. Turn the radio on. Amen. And you'll hear them. Give out somebody that's went out of this old world. Amen. The main important thing is, are they ready to go? Are you ready to go? Do you have anything in your heart honey, that will keep you out of heaven? Amen. I want you to know something. Honey, it just takes one thing. One thing. Thing, one thing, amen, to keep you out. You see, we look at people, as my brother brought down this morning, you dress right, you look right, and you talk right, but there's a lot of people got things in their heart. Amen, face one thing in that heart, it'll knock you out of heaven. Amen, these people got things against people, and they won't ask forgiveness, and they won't fix it up. Honey, this heart's got to be pure. It's got to be pure. Only the pure in heart shall see God. The more we cut them, I got to ya. Amen, I tell ya. Honey, I want you to know something. Honey, that devil has tried too many years to stop me and to set me down. And so many times, death has took a hold of this old body. 
honey, but God was not through with me. Amen. That's why I'm still here tonight. Amen. I'm like old Nehemiah. I said this the other night. I'm on the wall, and I'm not about to come down. I'm not about to come off. I'm done a good work, and I'm going to stay on the wall. I'm the more recordable And God told me the other night, he said, my son, they all not against you. He said, they all not against you. There's some. But he said, if I be for you, who in the world can be against you tonight? My God, honey, I'm here to tell you, I'm going to preach if it her lips the devil. I'm the more we cut them all, God tell you. I don't care what nobody says, what nobody does. Honey, I'm on my way to heaven. Woo, hallelujah. Honey, they something about this. Honey, I want you to know it's better than what the world's got. It's better than what the devil's got. And it's worth every mile. Honey, that you travel for the Lord. Would you give him a great big hand clap tonight? <laughs> And I preach a little while tonight. Amen. Praise God. Amen. And the Bible said, listen. Amen. If so that ye have me have heard him and have been taught by him as the truth is in Jesus. Honey, even their little children and their teenagers, honey, they know about Jesus. You know why? Because we got Sunday school teachers and we got ministers. Amen. And we teach them the same thing. Amen. I want you to know that. Honey, this is why. Honey, they understand what the Word of God is saying. Amen. The 22nd verse said that ye put off concern on the formal conversation on the old man which is corrupt according to the deceitful laws. Honey, the old man honey, is corrupt. And they say amen. Honey, but when you come to Jesus, amen, he does away with the old man. He gives you a new man. He does away with the old heart. He does away with the old conversation. My friend, if you still talk, honey, the same old talk. If you still do, honey, the same old things. Amen, you're still corrupt. Amen, you ain't laid off the old man. My God, hear me. Honey, I'm here to tell you. Honey, I laid off the old man. I laid off the old coat. I put on the new coat. And I put on the new man. And I don't regret them all. I'm the more we court of my Kataya. And I'll drop you another bombshell. I don't have no problem living right. I don't have no trouble living for Jesus. But my God, I don't have no problem. Reading and studying the word of God. Woo, glory. Can I preach it tonight? Thank God. I'm here to tell the people something. Honey, they ain't but one way to heaven. Amen. And I want you to know, honey, they ain't but one way to hell. Woo, hallelujah. Oh, I hear, honey, the word of God. Begin to explain it. Self. Amen. If we and it would realize that we need Jesus. A more than a dead man needs a coffin. Honey, we'd get some horse with Jesus. Amen. I call upon him. Amen. Several times a day. I read his word. Honey, I want you to know something. Woo glory. He has never left me. I said he's never left me. Uh, through sickness uh, on my deathbed uh, when I didn't even know I was in the world uh, he was right there uh, he never left me uh, he never left me uh, and he won't leave you uh, I said he won't leave you uh, and when sickness comes uh, uh, we shouldn't have a pity party uh, we should smile uh, and count it all joy uh, and say Lord it's gonna be alright uh, you tuck the stripes on your back uh, for my healing at the old whip and post. Uh, amen. And I know uh, my healing's going to come. Uh, woo, glory. Uh, raise him hands and glorify. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done 
done great to be a young man. Come on. Amen. Amen. I said, I'm done great to be a young Amen. man. Hallelujah. Amen. Woo! <laughs> Went down uh, and prayed for a friend and sit in jail and them dog. This evening, amen, they were sick. Amen, I looked at him. <laughs> amen, prayed for him, he walked a little better. Amen, praise the Lord, and he was having a problem. And I said, well, you like your papa, you're getting up in yours. <laughs> amen, praise the Lord, sometimes you gotta have him be carried around a little bit, amen. Praise the Lord, thank God, amen. But I don't know how you feel, but I believe in praying for dogs. I believe in praying for animals. Amen. Yes, I do. Amen. God made them too, didn't he? <clears throat> and a dog is a great helpmate to a lot of people. Amen. Amen. And all the animals. Amen. Every one of them was put here on earth for a purpose and a reason. Amen. And I know some of them is evil and some of them you don't like and some of them you can't trust. Amen. But praise God. I want you to know something. They are a comfort to a lot of people. Amen. And I know by experience. Amen. Praise the Lord. Me and my wife. Amen. We buried several dogs. Amen. And by the way, they had cancer too. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank God. But listen. God can heal cancer. Amen. Yes, he can. He can heal a heart attack. He can heal sugar diabetes. The worst thing anybody ever done. I thank God from Sister Melissa. Amen. She's got, got to go through some surgery. And she's had a lot of problems. But every time I talk to her, amen. Hallelujah. She cried on me one time. Amen. But since then, she's been happy. Amen. And counted all joy. Amen. You say, preacher, we can't do that. Honey, there ain't no such thing as kinked. That's right, man. Take that T off and what does it say? Can what? Take that T off and what does it say? Can. Amen. Praise the Lord. Something's going to take us all out of this old world. Amen. But let's go out with a smile on her face. Amen. Amen. Jim Singlin said, when I die, he'd have to wear my mouth together. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. I hope he does. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. But don't worry about it. I got everything fixed. You won't have to worry about it. Amen. All right. Thank God. Let me go on. Amen. I feel something here tonight. Amen. I'm glad I've been taught about Jesus. Amen. Yes, I am. I praise God. I'm glad. When I would begin to read to find my wife wrong. I'm glad I found her right. Amen. Praise God. Amen. That's right. And I gave my heart and life to Jesus. Amen. And I want you to know something. I was working in the mines at that time. And, and I'll tell you how sincere I am about serving Jesus. Amen. We was I laid off a time to high shift. Amen. From the work. And was baptized. Amen. Honey, the preacher had a baptized on Saturday and we worked on Saturday time to hype in the mines that was big money amen but I laid off and went and was baptized you know why I was afraid I may die before I had an opportunity to be baptized a lot of people just keep putting it off putting it off putting it off you can put it off too long and you will hallelujah you need to do it when the spell is up on you. Yeah, amen. I'm preaching you something tonight. I'm telling you something tonight. Amen. If you believe in Jesus Christ, honey, a lot of people, just about everybody you hear, will pray in the name of Jesus, but they will not go to the watery grave and be buried with him. Amen. And there's a lot of people and he will be buried with him but their heart's not with him amen they're not sincere and they're still worship amen trinity three gods and some four gods and I believe that God is a jealous God he said I'll have no other gods before me amen and if you've got other gods and before you he's a jealous Jealous God. I said it. Woo, Hadamo, we cut him. I cut Woo, hallelujah. 
And can I preach it tonight? Honey, I'm here to tell you. Honey, God is like this. If a man is married and got a wife and he's cheating on his wife and she finds out about it, and she's jealous. Amen. And she's got a right to be. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> and jealousy is cool in the grave. I'm here to tell you, we're married to him. We're married to him. Amen. Yes, I'm married to my wife, but we're also married to him. When we come to him, amen. Praise God, I want you to know something. And he becomes her heavenly father also. Amen. Thank God. Boys, I feel good tonight. You might as well just to take it easy. Hallelujah. Amen. Because there's something about ready to happen. There's something about ready to take place. Amen. And the Bible said, amen. Let me see where it was at. In the 23rd verse. And, and be renewed in the spirit of your mind. Of your, you know the devil talks to your mind. Even when you sleep, he'll bring old dreams to your mind. Amen. A lot of people don't know the difference. They say, God gave me a dream. Amen. If it's not about God, if it's not about heaven, if it's not about the good things, amen. It said, I want you to know it's not from God. Honey, the Bible teaches us all good things that come down from above. Amen. Hear me. Honey, the devil. And it will bring things to your mind. Especially if you watch these old filthy movies. Amen. Thank God. Amen. And go to bed. Honey, you'll dream some old stuff. Amen. And you even think people's against you. Amen. Praise God. You know when Brother Austin is preaching on all this stuff, I can holler amen and shout because I don't know anything about a ball game. Me and my wife never did go to these old movies. We never did watch this stuff. Amen. We don't set up 11 to 12 o'clock. Never did. Amen. We in the bed by 9. Amen. Thank God that's right. Most of them up by 5. Amen. Run to go. Amen. I don't know anything honey about Facebook and that's why I can't preach on it. I'm not going to preach on something if God don't give it to me I don't know about. I've never seen Facebook. I don't know what it is. I don't know anything about the internet. I don't know anything about ball games. Never been to a ball game. Never watched a ball game. Amen. Don't know anything about. We don't watch filthy movies. We don't know anything about that. Thank God. Honey, but I can preach about alcoholic. I can preach about car races. I can preach about gambling. And I'm sure my brother Austin can't preach about that because he didn't go to him. Amen. He didn't gamble. Amen. I want you to know I'm a, I am was a gambling man. Amen. Yes, I was. I was a car racing man. Amen. I was an alcoholic. Amen. I went to shooting matches. And that's a gambling game. I never bought a lot of tickets in my, in my life. Amen. And we got Christian people. Amen. They will buy a lottery tickets and spend every dime they got. Honey, I'm here to tell you if I preach something to you, I want to know what I'm bringing to you. That's why I listen, honey, to the broadcast. Honey, when I preach, I want to know what I'm feeding my people. Honey, a lot of people don't care what they feed the people. The more he the more But I want to know what you eating. I want to know what I'm dishing out to you. Amen. When my wife cooks a good meal, I want to know what I'm eating. Amen. And it's good for you. Honey, this word of God is food. Amen. And it will come. Amen. And it will feed the inner man. Amen. If you don't get honey, the right kind of food, honey, that inner man, honey, will die. Amen. If you don't get the right kind of food for the natural food for the natural
natural man. And in the natural man will die. And the we cut him And you can look at a lot of people and you see their anorexia because they don't get the right kind of food. And they say amen. Also you can see any people that don't get the right kind of spiritual food. I'm glad that's all you get here. Amen. With the we cut a back You get good food to feed any the inner man. Yeah, man. I'm here to tell you tonight. And it's something I need to serve the Lord. It's something to be obedient unto his voice and unto the word of God. Amen. And the Bible said, listen. Amen. And that he put on the new man which after God is created in righteousness and true wholeness. Amen. Righteousness and true wholeness. And there's a false wholeness. But also there's a true wholeness. Amen. And that true wholeness will speak for itself. I remember a time when we went to church. I was just young. Amen. And this lady got up in the pulpit. Amen. And she was dressed right. And she looked right. And I told my wife, this is how a young Christian will do. I said, I like to have the same spirit. And that woman, God. And we seen her in a few days up in town. And she didn't have on enough clothes to water shotgun. And I looked up right in the middle of town. I said, Lord, forgive me for what I said. Amen. I want you to know and it true wholeness and it will speak for itself I believe it's wholeness or hell I believe we got to live up holy hands and it before the Lord and only the pure in heart I shall see God amen and the Bible said listen wherefore put in the way a lion speaking every man truth with his neighbor for we are members of of one another. Do you know we're members of one another? And a church is supposed to be one big happy family. Amen. Yes, it is. Amen. One big happy family. Amen. I want you to know. Amen. And you put away your lion. And you speak every man the truth with his neighbor. For we are members of one another. And we are members members of one another here in this place. We are brothers and sisters. Amen. And we're trying to help one another. Amen. And the Bible said, Be ye angry and sin not and let not the sun go down upon your raft. Amen. Angry is mad. Amen. I want you to know. Amen. You can get mad, but whatever comes in this mind Honey, you don't want to do it. And they say amen. Honey, these people, honey, I don't know about you, but sometimes these people, if I could, Brother Gene, I would put my hands around their neck. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. But the Holy Ghost, honey, won't let you do that. And they say amen. Honey, but I'm so glad tonight. Amen. We're serving the true and the living God. Do you get angry? Amen. Sure you do. Sometimes people will cross your path. Amen. You don't feel the same every day. Amen. No, you don't. Some mornings you'll get up and you're happy-go-lucky me. And the next morning you may get up and you won't be a happy-go-lucky me. Amen. Maybe somebody crossed your path on the job or you run into somebody. Honey, now these people can really stir you up. These people can really they get your blood a boil on. Amen. That's why we need the Holy Ghost. Amen. To help us through. Amen. And that Holy Ghost will lead you and he'll guide you into all truth and all righteousness. That's why we need the Holy Ghost. Amen. Praise God. Listen. Wherefore, put in 
a way line speaking every man truth with his neighbor for we are members of one another be ye angry and sin not let not the sun go down upon your wrath neither give place to the devil neither give place to the devil there's a lot of people gives place to the devil amen and we shouldn't do that because Jesus said I gave you power over the unclean spirit amen praise God hallelujah some of you thought I was coming against brother Austin I wasn't coming against brother Austin I was just telling the people these things that I'm not able to preach on because I'm not being there I'm not being there I'm proud of my grandson amen I'm proud of my associate amen he knows more about this stuff than I do I don't know anything about it amen and don't come against me over because I'm not coming against him amen praise God amen if I knowed it I would preach it I can't explain something that's not I'm not being there I'm not being there amen and like I say he's not been alcoholic so he can't tell you much about alcoholic just what he, people's told him and he knows a lot about his papa amen I want you to know that they know I want people to know that what I preach and what he preach we agree on amen we agree on amen and so don't so don't don't come against me when I'm preaching I don't care where you shout I don't care where you run when I pray for you I don't care where you do anything where you don't amen I just obey God amen that's right and uh, so that, that that's the way I've always been amen praise the Lord but I want you to know something tonight amen Jesus is the same God that was in the beginning in the same beginning he's still the same God tonight amen praise God he's not changed he said I change not amen I, he said I'm the same yesterday and forever and I change not amen well I want you to know something that's the way old brother Danny D is amen I'm the same amen from time I started in this thing to this end is going to be amen neither give place to the devil amen let him that stole steal no more but rather let him labor 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 everybody say labor, labor. working with his hands the things which is good that he may have to give to him that needeth amen work labor amen I want you to know something God cannot stand a lazy person amen, amen. he can't he can't stand the Bible teaches us if you don't work you can't eat amen you know what I'd be glad to go back to work tomorrow amen yes I would amen I've always worked I've always give I've always blessed other people God's always blessed me amen and I want you to know something you cannot out give God you cannot amen no matter how hard you try amen praise the Lord you cannot out give God and if you do it with free heart amen I'm talking about freedom now amen free heart if you give and you grudge it it won't do you no good it won't do you no good amen praise God I want you to know something amen and you never hear me boast and say the things that I do the things that I give and when I where I help people you never hear me boast and brag about it amen because if I give in secret God will reward me openly amen praise God I'm serving a true and living God amen let me hurry to let no corrupt communication proceed out of your mouth oh think about this but that which is good 
to the using of edifying that it may minister grace unto the hearers. Amen. And grieve not the Holy Spirit of God, whereby ye are sealed unto the day of redemption. Amen. You know we are sealed by the Holy Ghost until the day of redemption. Amen. And this is why anything that we have in our heart against someone, amen, you're not going to make it to heaven. Amen. And I want you to know that. Amen. You can't have hatred. You can't have jealousy. You can't have this stuff. No matter what it is, even if somebody's done you wrong, you've got to be willing to forgive. Amen. That's right. And, uh, and I'm going to drop you a bombshell. We all, I said we all, have been done wrong. But I can tell you, I don't have an all against nobody in my heart. Amen. If I die right now, I hope to see you up in heaven. Amen. Praise God. Amen. And grieve not the Holy Spirit of God, whereby ye are sealed unto the day of redemption. Let all bitterness and wrath and anger and clamor and evil speaking be put away from you with all malice put away from you. Amen. You've got to find that in your heart to forgive people. Amen. No matter what they have done, no matter what may come your way. Amen. And, and said, be ye kind to one another, uh, tender hearted, forgiving one another, even as God for Christ's sake has forgiven you. Amen. Can you imagine if you let your mind go back before you came to God? Amen. What kind of sin and what kind of thought and what kind of things that you did do when you was in sin. And when you come to Jesus, amen, he, did, he forgave you of all of them, not just part of them. Amen. And if God forgave us, amen, God forgave us, we've got to forgive one another. Amen. Yes, we do. Amen. I want you to know something. Amen. I've tried to be a pastor for all these years uh, to the people. Amen. And, and some gets upset at me. Some gets mad at me. And, amen. But thank God there's some that stands with us. Amen. Praise the Lord down through the years. Amen. But I want you to know we don't compromise. We don't back up. We don't sit down. We get up and we march forward. Amen. And you never regret receiving the word of God. Amen. And we need to know the spirit of truth, the spirit of her. Amen. Praise God. I tell you. Amen. Praise the Lord. Well, Brother Austin, I preached again tonight. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank God. Amen. But uh, I want you to know something tonight. God is so great and God is so good. Amen. And it's not hard to live for Jesus if your heart's in it. But if your heart ain't in it, it's hard to live for Jesus. Because if your heart's not in it, amen, you won't pray. You won't read the Word of God. You'll find something else to do. You won't come to church. You won't assemble yourself together. And the Bible said, forget not to assemble yourself together in the house of the Lord. Amen. And I want you to know the last three months, amen, or something like that, we have been uh, preaching the gospel, amen. We haven't lost the service, amen. But it's not the same. How many can say it's not the same? Amen. And I want you to know this. Amen. Praise God, but it's better to be assembled together in the house of the Lord. Amen. And I want you to know God is looking down right now. Amen. Praise the Lord. And you know we got to baptize them, but I'm going to give an altar call. Amen. And see if anybody uh, is lost without God. See if anybody wants to come and pray. See if anybody wants to get the Holy Ghost. See if anybody wants to go and be baptized. Uh, here in a little bit, amen. Praise the Lord as they begin to sing a song tonight, amen. And you begin to bow your head in a word of prayer. I wonder tonight if there's anybody that will come and gave your heart to Jesus. This is what it's all about, amen. You're here tonight. Please don't turn hey, God away. Please don't turn God away. 
find us where I want yes, to Lord. be. Are you lost without God? Are you lost without God? I see Are you about to well, Do you have the Jesus. Holy Ghost? I Do you have the Holy Ghost? If yes, they want tonight, would you come? Will you come? Will you come from us? Will you raise up our blessings? Will you come? Yes, Lord. Yes, we are Nikos. Would you just where I want to be? Are you lost without God? Are you lost without God? Will you come? Will you come? Will you come? Oh, how the sky will see. Glory, thank you, Jesus. Will you come and pray tonight? A beautiful you paradise. Will you come? For you oh, yes, God bless these children at night. God oh, sit down by oh, the tree of life oh, and watch a crystal oh, sea oh, because oh, heaven oh, is where I want oh, to be. Are you lost tonight? Are you lost tonight? Are you lost? Hey, oh, will you come tonight? Will you come tonight? Where I want to be. Are you lost tonight? Are you lost? Or your a city where you will live. Oh, you Jesus. don't have to leave the way you come. You don't have to leave the way you come. Will you come? Oh, hell, I raise that promise. Will you raise that promise? That goes with me. Yes, Lord. It's where I need God's heaven. Will you come? It's where I want to be. be. Oh, God bless these children. God bless these children. Oh, oh, I I'm planning a call and home. Oh, come before his presence. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, God, you're lost tonight. Where you come? We'll tell this simple world goodbye. We'll tell this world so long we're gone. Cause heaven is where I want to be. Hallelujah. Heaven. Do you need the Holy Ghost? Do you need the Holy Ghost? Do you need anything with God? A city where we'll live with Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. I'm a reign of king. Oh, heaven is a promised land that flows with me. And sweet honey, that's heaven. It's where I want to be. Have I no sweet heaven? I'm planning a car way home. Oh, come before his presence at his judgment throne. Anyone else? Hallelujah. We'll tell this simple word goodbye. We'll tell this word. It's a long work on Cause heaven It's where I want to be Heaven It's where I want to be Lord bless the Lord God watch over the Lord In the name of Jesus I swear he will Live with Jesus I will reign again 